Welcome to Auto Intel, strap in, everyone, because the Tesla Model 2 is racing into showrooms next month, and it's stirring up more excitement than a dog spotting a squirrel. A crystal clear rollout plan has already spilled the beans, mapping out exactly how this spunky little car is set to take over 19 markets from 2025 through 2028. It's got the EV world buzzing like someone just kicked over a beehive, especially with a price tag dropping just above $10,000 once you pile on all the juicy discounts. And the wild part. We haven't even checked out its slick design or clever features yet. Imagine a car so cool it makes your old bicycle hang its head in shame. The real proof would be laying eyes on this beauty ourselves, but the early specs alone are creating more noise than a Monday morning coffee shop. So how exactly did the Model 2's secret production plan leak out? And could this be the boldest compact EV deal out there right now? Let's jump into how the Tesla Model 2 flipped the script with a schedule so gutsy it feels like a dare. Kicking off in June 2025, the Austin factory will start rolling out 10,000 Model 2s every single week. That's half a million cars in the first year alone, enough to pack a parking lot the size of a small city. By 2027, that number jumps to a jaw-dropping 1 million cars annually, practically flooding the roads with affordable Teslas. This massive 12 million square foot facility is like something out of a sci-fi flick, loaded with high-tech casting equipment and smart assembly lines where robots do about 80% of the heavy lifting. It's basically a dance floor for mechanical arms, sleek, fast, and way more coordinated than your uncle at a wedding. That kind of automation slashes labor costs by 30% compared to what it takes to build a Model 3 or Y, making the whole operation efficient enough to promise delivery times that might just beat your pizza guy. And with solar panels and wind turbines scattered around the site, energy costs drop by 15%, helping Tesla hit that magical $25,000 starting price, no need to wait around for some futuristic battery tech that's always just out of reach. Starting in 2026, Tesla's going all-in on customization with versions tailored for different climates, not as some overpriced upgrade, but as part of the car's core design. Picture Las Vegas drivers sweating through triple-digit summers, now imagine their Model 2 keeping its cool with a beefed-up AC system, preconditioned cabin air, and a battery that shrugs off heat waves. Flip the scenario, and you've got the same car holding its own in sub-zero winters, keeping its range and charging speed up even when the weather's throwing a fit. Unlike older automakers that treat weatherproofing like an optional dessert, Tesla's baking it right into the main dish. And the rollout schedule. It reads like a spy thriller with every move planned like a chess master. From January to June 2026, the first wave lands in major U.S. cities. Austin ships out to L.A. in January think Hollywood stars swapping their limos for Model 2s, followed by New York in February, where even the taxi drivers might do a double take. By spring, cars hit the southeast and mountain west, then smaller U.S. cities in the second half of the year. Meanwhile, right-hand drive versions are headed to the U.K. and Western Europe from Tesla's Berlin plant, London alone is expecting 15,000 units in Q3, along with four new charging stations forming a protective ring around the M25 like knights guarding a castle. Come January to June 2027, the third wave targets Australia, Sydney first, where even the kangaroos might raise an eyebrow. Canada and the rest of Europe follow, and cars will roll out of a brand new facility near Botany that can process 300 vehicles a day, faster than a barista churning out lattes at peak hour. Between July and December 2027, the fourth rollout reaches China, India, Japan, Thailand, and Singapore with versions tweaked for each region. And by 2028, Latin America jumps in, bringing Tesla's vision full circle, blanketing the globe with EVs like a cozy electric quilt. By pacing each factory's launch with actual demand, Tesla avoids the headache of giant pre-order lists followed by delivery delays that feel longer than waiting at the DMV, something that frustrated plenty of early Model 3 buyers. And building in Texas instead of California cuts shipping distances to either coast by 20%, shaving $1,800 off each car, money that could buy you a top-tier coffee machine. 
making cars directly in Europe and Australia skips import tariffs, saving another $2,200 per unit, cash Tesla uses to keep that price tag under $25,000, even with dealer fees and local taxes. Add in the savings from sourcing parts locally, about $1,000 saved per vehicle, and you've got a business model that's lean, clean, and laser-focused. The online ordering system opens up from September 20th to 25th, but the real game-changer is a smart delivery tool that processes real-time production, bin assignments, and shipping logistics to predict your delivery within a tight 10-day window. That's sharper than your grandma's knitting needles, and a serious upgrade from the Model Y days. You can secure a spot with a $250 refundable deposit, cheaper than a Friday night at the movies. Current Tesla owners get first dibs in November 2025, fleet buyers jump in by January 2026, and the general public can get in line with no reservation starting April 2026. For retirees, families on tight budgets, or first-timers eyeing their first EV, a solid delivery date is almost as sweet as the price itself, it's like knowing your birthday cake is going to show up right on time. Tesla's flexing its financial clout too, locking in ultra-low loan rates, down to 0.9% in the US and around 1.2% to 2% in Europe, plus insurance bundles 15% to 25% cheaper than traditional providers, thanks to local repair networks and fast parts delivery. And each factory's hosting monthly owner meetups, behind-the-scenes tours, and tech workshops to turn early adopters into loyal superfans who'll rave louder than a karaoke champion. A second factory, likely near Austin to share parts and people, is penciled in for 2028. That brings the total output to a mind-blowing 2 million Model 2s a year, about 12% of the 2024 US car market. That's not just a ripple, it's a tidal wave, forcing rivals to either keep up or shut down. So why should anyone care that the Model 2 is so affordable? Well, picture yourself sliding into a brand new Tesla that costs less than your cousin's clunky 2010 hatchback. Insiders say the base price could land at a jaw-dropping $25,000, and that's even before discounts. Sound too good to be true? Pinch yourself, it's real. Thanks to federal tax credits for EVs under $55,000, buyers can knock off $7,500, turning that $25,000 car into a $17,500 steal. Add in state incentives, up to $2,500 in California, around $2,000 in places like New York and Texas, and the price drops closer to $15,000. That's less than a decent gaming rig or a used car with more history than your grandpa's photo album. Tesla's direct-to-customer model cuts out middlemen entirely, no haggling, no sketchy dealer fees, no sneaky upsells. The price online is what you pay. No surprises. It's like ordering a burger and getting your fries free, no extra charge for the ketchup. Compare that to the market. The average new EV costs over $55,000 and even gas cars average almost $50,000. The cheapest EV on the map, the 2025 Nissan LEAF, still starts above $29,000. Gas-powered compact cars like the Honda Civic and Toyota Corolla float between $20,000 and $21,500, but they don't qualify for federal EV credits. Now imagine a $13,999 Model 2. That's 70% to 80% cheaper than the average EV, and over 50% less than a basic gas car. That's like scoring a steak dinner for the price of a sandwich. This kind of pricing doesn't just rattle the market, it could totally rewrite who gets to drive electric. Struggling families could finally ditch their gas guzzlers. First-time EV buyers, usually scared off by sticker shock, might actually feel welcome. Cities trying to go green get a fresh wave of electric adoption and new jobs from factory growth. Everybody wins. But here's the big question, how the heck does Tesla cram all its famous speed and safety into a car cheaper than your phone plan? If the bargain price makes you worry Tesla cut corners, the early performance numbers will make you smile like a kid on Christmas. Insiders say the Model 2 can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 5 seconds, 
fast enough to leave sportier sedans choking on your dust. And that's just the base model. You'll get about 226 miles of range on the standard battery, or up to 298 miles with the long-range pack, enough for two weeks of regular commuting without ever touching a charger, unless you're planning a road trip to visit every diner in the country. It's ultra-efficient, getting 4.1 miles per kilowatt-hour, one mile more than the average EV, so charging costs are lower too. It's like getting a bonus slice of pizza you didn't order. That efficiency comes from a sleek, aerodynamic design that slices through the air with a drag coefficient of just 0.219, better than nearly anything in its class. Under the hood, well, under the floor, Tesla's using lithium iron phosphate batteries that cost around $80 per kilowatt hour, about 40% cheaper than the Model 3 cells. That means more range, more speed, and still more savings. V3 superchargers fill the battery up to 80% in just 20 to 25 minutes, perfect for a snack break and a leg stretch. The battery itself? Built to last up to 950,000 miles with hardly any degradation, so you might just hand it down to your grandkids. The frame borrows from Tesla's space tech, with a honeycomb structure and a one-piece aluminum rear, making it both lighter and tougher than most stitched steel frames out there. It's like wearing armor for your daily drive. The battery system includes 14 cooling sensors and 12 split battery sections, so if anything overheats, it's isolated in a flash. Safety-wise, experts expect a 5-star rating and crash protection that's three times stronger than the legal minimum. It's basically a tank disguised as a budget car. Maintenance? Practically none. No oil changes, no spark plugs, and most fixes are handled by mobile techs in under an hour. Tesla estimates just $2,700 in maintenance over five years. Throw in electric power instead of gas, and you're looking at $17,245 in total ownership costs over five years, that's about $11,500 less than a Toyota Corolla. Like picking a budget vacation and still having money left for souvenirs. Tesla's keeping quality high, with rocket-grade aluminum and a one-piece battery setup managed by smart sensors. And unlike the competition, Tesla includes its full self-driving hardware standard, no surprise fees later. Software updates keep it learning like a puppy that never stops improving. The batteries are rated for a million miles, making range anxiety a thing of the past. Electricity averages just 19 cents per mile, and maintenance is a breeze. Compared to gas-powered cars, the Model 2 costs 42% less to own and operate. Even depreciation's been considered, Tesla's offering a $4,000 buyback guarantee, and the hot demand for used EVs could mean this car holds its value better than you'd expect. All of this blurs the line between budget and premium. A sub-$14,000 post-discount Tesla isn't just hype, it's a reset button for the whole industry. So, what do you think? Does the Model 2 live up to the hype? Drop your thoughts below, give us a thumbs up if you're buzzing like a kid on a sugar rush, and be sure to follow for more electrifying Tesla news. We're just as excited as a dog with a new squeaky toy. Catch you in the next video.